Das Kapital. Gray buildings, islands of buildings with blunt robot eyes in the smoky twilight. I wander on broken rocks, a friend to the sick trees on the boulevard, their leaves black with ash and diesel fumes. Overhead, sirens scream on the freeway. Down a river of flying steel, the workers cruise home to their electric cages for another night of sloth and stupor. At a newsstand on the corner, a man is breathing cancerous fumes from his shirt of plastic. The markets are full of poisoned food, razors in the Halloween candy. Soon it is night, and winds of loneliness whine through the cable harps of bridges. The streets are full of crowds prowling in the darkness, bridled with asps and silver coins for eyes. Mazes, drunken lights, whirlwinds of forgetfulness. In a cellar, the jazz horns moan like wounded hippos, and madmen crash drums, beating on skins and precious metals to vent their daily rage. Under stairways of the carnival, in pleasure domes and pain parlors, Faces leer from torn leather booths. Zombies sell the powdered stars of El Dorado and the fumes of Persian utopias. In hotels, the witches feast on snake spit, hatching a new plague. Their tongues, like flames, Ignite the forest in the thigh of a lover in a room anonymous as a cough at the bus stop. Lines of panhandlers with lost, wrinkled eyes wait outside the mission for stale bread, huddling in doorways, vacant lots, under piers and moldy wharves, clinging to a bottle and a lantern of bones. Scavengers, possessed by crow spirits, rummage in the alleys, searching trash cans for fish eyes, dog lips, pomegranates full of blood, the vomit of banquets, and pastries smeared on broken stained glass windows. They are the children of progress, the end result, creatures unfit for jails or asylums, lost in the ruins. Slowly, dawn spreads a few weak rays through the trapezoids and metal minarets. From the avenues, the stench of urine and exhaust fills the capital with a brown cloud. Along the gutters, men in overalls sweep up the remains of night into piles. Painters sandblast the walls of the arcade and erase the secret messages of the desperate damned. In a garden of iron, acid rain drips and singes tear stains on the faces of statues. Our forefathers weeping in the park. A fanfare of tubas for our president, the impeccable puppet and his cabinet of dolls. The real puppeteer is hiding in a dark room at the top of a pyramid of power, emperor of the corporations and war machines, greedy and engorged, 
reclined on pillows over the great seal of the dollar. He controls the people with gestures of his one eye that glows in the shadows like an open sore. <laughs> 